service-oriented architecture becoming more and more prevalent, more and more composable, more and more easy for development teams like your like Ave to both add new components to in the form of DeFi protocol contracts and for others to then feed value into those DeFi protocol contracts, which are supported by additional services like price feeds and randomness and you know, weather data for insurance products that then become collateral. And so I kind of see a future where both the composability from the DeFi projects making new additional services in the form of smart contracts that do various things with financial products, generate various financial products, various gaming products that then might also generate collateral for DeFi and services um, put on chain through systems like Chainlink, where you have signed data provided on chain by people running their own Chainlink nodes. You have the Chainlink network purchasing data from various data sources that don't want to change their infrastructure and providing it very efficiently uh, to the DeFi ecosystem and the insurance ecosystem, the gaming ecosystem, so that those ecosystems can have all the kind of building blocks, the different services that they need to compose in order to make their use case work. And I think the faster we can do all that and the more different composable pieces there are, the, the more that our industry and our space begins to look like the web industry and we begin to build at web speeds. I think the, the real challenge is how do you build these composable building blocks, but how do you also do it in a, in a secure way that abstracts security concerns away from the people that are then composing those building blocks together in secure ways. And so you, you want speed from the point of view of developers building things. And you also want to provide them with a system that guarantees certain levels of security while they're speedily composing these various building blocks together.